Good evening, welcome to Monday's World of Weather. Clicked on to long range weather forecast discussion for April 29th to May 11th. For the period from April 29th to May 3rd, models remain in agreement with a split flow across the nation. Uh, we still have these area large positive anomalies across um, near Greenland, northern um, North America, and we have an upper low here over eastern Canada, trough in the west, above normal heights in the east. Miles are good agreement. We go to the third. We see a little change. We go through the models. We see a little change in the elevator circulation. During this period, an active pattern is forecast. Expected this period due to the movement of an upper low in the west. This will likely cause heavy precipitation and severe weather from the west, westward into the Mississippi, uh, Mississippi Valley and into the east. We're going to look now at the pier from May 2nd to the 6th. Here we are at the 3rd. And we go now to the 6th. And we still have a split flow. Here's a southern stream. Here's a northern stream. We still have our upper low here, above normal heights here. They seem to weaken compared to what they were in the previous period. See back here. Now they seem to weaken, and we go through the models. And you can see we have a trough here over the southwest, maybe uh, the western states. Still have a trough here near um, the Aleutians. And this is in agreement with the Climate Prediction Ensembles and the G GFS Super Ensembles. So during this forecast period, I am forecasting above normal temperatures here. Here I'm forecasting temperatures to be 6 to 18 degrees above normal, below normal temperatures across the region east of the Mississippi River. And there I'm expecting temperatures to be 3 to 9 degrees below normal. Precipitation. Call for below normal precipitation here, above normal precipitation for the Southern Rockies, and also above normal precipitation for the southeast, the Middle Atlantic, and the northeast. Can okay, look now at the period from May 7th to the 11th. Here we are at the 7th. Still have somewhat like a split flow, the northern stream here, southern stream here. And we go now to the 11th. And you can still see we have an upper low here, trough off the west coast. Trough somewhat the east, off the southeast coast, above normal heights here. This is the GFS. And we look at the GFS ensembles, has a trough in the east. And also European ensembles. And I don't have the Canadian. But um, this is how the pair will look like. I think more of the ensemble, so during this forecast period, I'm forecasting above normal temperatures here, where temperatures are 3 to 15 degrees above normal, below normal temperatures from the lower Mississippi Valley into the interior mid-Atlantic. There, I'm forecasting temperatures to be 3 to 9 degrees below normal. Precipitation. Calling for below normal precipitation for the northern Rockies into the upper Mississippi Valley, above normal precipitation from the southern plains, eastward to the Pacific Coast, and for the southeast. So that is a long-range weather forecast discussion for April 29th to May 11th. Thanks for coming to Germany's World of Weather, and have a good day.